Now moving on, the Ghana Real Estate Developers Association, GREDA, is calling on government to provide a clear outline of its expectations from Quam LMI Consortium, the newly appointed developer tasked with completing the long-delayed Saglami housing project. This follows successful negotiations between a government team, including representatives from the Ministries of Finance, Works and Housing and the Consortium. My colleague Daniel Odromesa reports. The completion of the Saglemi housing project is expected to have a major impact on Ghana's housing sector addressing part of the country's 1.8 million housing unit deficit. Kwam LMI Consortium, a Ghanaian conglomerate involved in construction, property development, logistics, utilities and ICT has been selected to finish the 5,000 affordable housing units, of which only 1,506 are partially completed. The redevelopment will be organized through a special purpose vehicle, with the government's current investment in the project being treated as equity. This means both the government and the developer would recover their investments when the project is finalized. The government move comes after the Ghana Institute of Surveyors estimated that an additional $100 million would be needed to complete the 1,506 unfinished units. Funds that the government could not provide prompting the decision to bring in a private developer to complete the project. As a new developer rolls out the completion of the project, the Ghana Real Estate Developers Association wants the government to be clear on its expectations from the developer. Samuel Amegaibo is the executive secretary for the Ghana Real Estate Developers Association. Uh, we are not too sure what government expectations are. Is government looking at recovering its expenses uh, at the price of the houses that will be sold? What are we looking at in terms of the investor coming on board at this stage to do what? To complete it and then we we'll put all the costs together and sell it, uh, maybe if you, even if it is to break even, to sell it at the even cost so that what government recovers the investment or we all agree that this is a lost investment so the developer is coming to continue so that it will be sold at affordable prices to Ghanaians. In fact, these are the concerns that we have right now. The government says the selection of a new developer in reviving the Saglemi housing project is a significant initiative. The Ministry of Works and Housing has noted that it is confident that the completion of the project will go a long way to address the country's housing deficit. For CNR Business, my name is Daniel Odrio Mensah.